My time in high school hasn't been always easy. Freshman year was a struggle, um, but it just got better since then. Like sophomore year, a little bit better. Junior year was probably my best year, and then senior year right now, it's, it's great. Um, my high school experience, it was pretty easy at first. The only difficult time I had was probably during Algebra 2. Um, that class was just bad for me because I didn't want to ask questions or get help that I needed, but eventually I got myself together. Um, my time in high school definitely um, you know, has its ups and downs, has its roller coasters. It hasn't been easy throughout the whole process. Definitely trying to like time manage. That's definitely probably a big issue that not only I have, but I think a lot of people have too. Um, you know, with homework, schoolwork, and also outside school, trying to have a social life. So that's one part. One of my um, favorite memories from high school is when we beat Everett like two years ago in football. Um, we beat them like 27 to 19, and the crowd was going crazy. We stormed the field, jumped on the football players. Like it was an exciting, like fulfilled moment. Um, the best part about high school, you meet new friends compared to middle school. Um, through my journey of high school, I've met my five my, um, best friends now, and I'll be living with them and seeing what happens. Yeah. Um, what I'm looking forward to is graduating, getting on that stage and knowing that I'm finally done after four years of ups and downs and making friends and just new experiences. I'm looking forward to just putting the final finishing touch. I'm looking forward to finishing my soccer season. I'm looking forward to applying to colleges. Getting, like finishing a plan of college because that's stressful and um, prom. This year I'm just looking forward to have fun, you know, senior year, be with my boys. Um, that's one thing, you know, just getting through everything probably that I didn't get a chance to do my first three years of high school. Uh, just ended off strong, you know, just take, take it eight at a time mostly though. Just have fun. I would uh, miss the people and some teachers. Some teachers were really like good to me and like told me to step up when it's when I had to step up for my grades and sports and friends because you know I hang out with my friends every day after school. So um, I'll miss seeing my friends, of course, every day and uh, the tight relationships with the teachers that we have here. Um, it's going to be sad because you see them for four years and then now you're probably never going to see them. Everyone's going out of state. Everyone's not staying local for college. Some advice I'd give to like upcoming freshmen and people who are still in high school is to um, build good relationships with your teachers. It'll be a lot easier on your gradings and it won't feel like everything's ten times harder. Um, some advice I would have to give to the youth or you know younger people below me is definitely um, just do your own thing. You know, obviously like do your schoolwork. You know, make sure that you get your priorities straight first. But you know, if you want to join a club, join a club. You know, have fun, play a sport. You know, don't let other people contradict what you know you want to make up your high school career. Pretty much. Um, advice is to get yourself involved with anything possible and to get the help that you don't think that you need but you should still try to get help because there's a bunch of resources that people don't take advantage of especially when it comes to your senior year it's going to be stressful so honestly like take a breath and then like relax make friends enjoy your high school like career as much as you can high school don't last forever <laughs>